this is Ron Soltio from RSP Media and this is a quick lesson on how to shoot jewelry with your iPhone. These images are perfect for inventory control, appraisals, social media, repairs, direct to customer contact, and jewelry stock balancing. RSP Media has set up a kit for photographing your jewelry on your own premises. The kit includes a tent, three-point lighting system, cosmetic mirrors used as reflectors, props to hold up jewelry, a rigging to hold up your iPhone, and a magnifying glass for macro focuses. Ring photography. Place your ring in the center of the set. Rotate it to the desired angle. Using two fingers, zoom in to the ring to magnify it and fill the frame. You adjust your lights to pick up the most desirable and attractive highlights. To go closer for more specular highlights or further back for softer light. You can use the cosmetic mirror to kick light into the diamonds. Once I have the desired highlights on the diamond on one side, I take my second mirror to pick up a few more highlights on the opposite side. Now that your lights and mirrors are in position and you really like the way your ring looks, click with your finger on the ring and hold it there for a few seconds, your exposure and focus would lock and then you can take your picture. If you want a variable exposure, click on another area, a darker area, and take an exposure of that as well. Earring photography. Place your earrings in the center of the set. Adjust your mirrors for the desired highlights. Hold your finger on the screen to get the exposure. And click your shutter. Necklace photography. Place the necklace on the bust, adjust your lights, bring in these lights a little more forward to pick up on the stones, adjust your mirrors, I like what I see, and I shoot it. Photographing a bangle, place the bangle in the desired position. work your lights. Since this is a dark wood bangle, I need to hit it with more specular light. Bring the light in front of the screen. Zoom in. Lock my focus and exposure and shoot. Macro jewelry photography with your iPhone. Place your iPhone horizontally after mounting your macro lens. Make sure it's nice and sturdy. Bring in any product that you want to shoot and position it in front of the lens to photograph the detail that you may need. Lock your focus and exposure and shoot. Now that I've captured my image, I go to the camera roll and I push on the envelope with the arrow and I can message the image to another phone, email it, tweet it, post it on Facebook or Flickr. 
I'm going to email the image to myself. To Ron. Subject matter is ring. And all I have to do is push send. It gives me a choice of sizes. I want to send the biggest image to my computer. I'm going to go with actual size. And there it goes.